What's up guys, Ghulam Ahmed with GeneActivated.ca. Welcome back to the Ramadan at home fat loss series. Today we're gonna to be doing day eight. We're gonna get right into it. So we're gonna start with three sets of 15 second football drill. We did three sets of 10 seconds last week. This week we're gonna take it up a little bit, uh, take it up a notch a little bit. So if we're ready to go, oh by the way, you're gonna need a stool for this one, okay? So this workout again, we're gonna need a stool. So go ahead and get that stool right now and then come back and you can start the workout right here, okay? So let's go. And hands up in front of you, bend your feet slightly, knees, and go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, and fifteen. So that was tough, huh? Getting a little twerk session in Ramadan. That was pretty good, huh? We got three sets now. That was pretty tough. You're gonna get a lot of burn in the quads. And I moved the mat a little bit too. So we're gonna do two more sets. We're gonna keep breathing, okay? You breathe and I'll fix my mat, okay? So again, you can pick up the pace by making taking smaller steps, okay? If you step too high, you're gonna feel, you're gonna take longer steps to come up. So small steps and fast, okay? And go, one, two, three, four, Five, ooh, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. So sometimes your body wants to do it, but your brain's not letting you do it, right? So that happens to me in a bit in between there. So if that happens, slow down and try to pick up your pace again. So let's breathe. That was your second set. And I keep moving my mat. There you go. Very nice, okay. Almost there guys, one more set, five seconds. You guys are doing great, four. Let's breathe one more time. Okay, are you ready? Let's go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, Nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, and fifteen. Whew, it's hard to do this while you talk at the same time. So that was great. Okay, so that was your three sets done. We're gonna take a minute break. We're gonna breathe, and we're gonna move on to the second exercise, which is gonna be push-ups again. But we're gonna do it a little bit different again today. Okay, so breathe. So I'm gonna fix my mat again. There we go. Hope you guys are doing good. Day day eight. So we're quite a few week, uh, days into Ramadan now. You should really start to see some results. So drop your weight a little bit. Especially if you've been following my diet plan. It's in the description below. Make sure you check it out. So you can really maximize the results in this month. So let's keep breathing. So guys, now we're gonna do push-ups, okay? So we've been doing them throughout this series quite a bit because I really want you to get good at doing push-ups. A lot of people struggle with that. And there's different ways to build strength. So today we're gonna do another technique that's gonna help you build some strength in your push-ups, which is gonna be going down in about two seconds and coming up in about two seconds. So it's like a two second tempo that you're gonna do. So you're not just gonna go down fast and come up fast. This is gonna help you to build some strength, okay? So what we're gonna do is, get the mat straight again and get down okay so hand right underneath the chest we're going to take two seconds to go down and then we're going to come back up also in two seconds so one two one two one two one two one two one three one two one four one two one, five, one, two, one, six. We're gonna do six to eight. One, two, one, seven. One, two, one, eight. Beautiful, guys. So now we're gonna take a 30 second break. 
What this does is it keeps more, it's called time under tension. It'll keep uh, more tension, more time uh, under tension for the muscle. So the muscle is gonna be under more tension for a longer period of time. That's why we just slow it down and have a nice tempo going. So it really helps to build some strength and also to build more muscle, right? So keep breathing. Okay, ready? Let's go, second set. So again, two seconds to come down, two seconds to come up. Ready, and let's go. One, two, one, one. One, two, one, two. One, two, one, three. One, two, one, four. One, two, one, five. One, two, one, six. One, two, one, seven. One, two, one, eight. Beautiful, guys. Good job. So that's your second set. Let's take 30 seconds to breathe. Hope you guys are enjoying these videos, guys. Make sure you guys let me know in the comment section below how you're liking them. Make videos of you guys doing the workouts. Send them to me on my Instagram. I love to see what you guys are doing and how you guys are working out. It really helps to motivate me to keep going. Okay, let's do the last set. Ready and go. One, two, one, two. One, two. One, two, one, two, one, three, one, two, one, four, one, two, one, five, one, two, one, six, one, two, one, seven. Good job. One more. One, two, one, eight. Whoa. Good job guys, so that was great. I'm getting a little sweaty, so my hands are sticking to the mat. So that's good, that was your second exercise in the books. Let's breathe for one minute, and then we're gonna do the third exercise, which is gonna be the same that we did last week for our abs. It's gonna be a reverse crunch exercise. We're gonna add a few more reps, okay? So let's breathe. Very nice, in through your nose, out through your mouth. Beautiful. Okay, so we're gonna get ready to do the next exercise now. It's called the reverse crunch exercise. We're gonna lie down on the floor, right? We're gonna keep our hands against the floor at the bottom and make sure the back stays flat against the, back, uh, against the, the, the ground, okay? Your back should not have an arch or get a bit of a gap in it, especially the lower back. So we're gonna do three sets of 10 to 12 reverse crunches, okay? So bring your knees in and push them out and pull them back. One, two, three, four. Now you don't have to go that low if you can't, if it's really tough, you can go up here as well. Five, like this, six, but you wanna pull back with your stomach. Seven, not with your legs. Eight, okay? And if you can go lower, go lower. Nine. 10. 11, and good. Very nice, guys. 12, so now we're gonna take a 30 second break. Breathe, and then we're gonna do the second set. So in this exercise, as you take your legs out, your back will start to Give a little bit from the lower back, from the lower from the lower part of your back. Make sure you don't let that happen. Make sure you keep the lower back flat against the pad, okay? Against the wall. Sorry, against the, the ground, okay? Breathe. You guys are doing great. Okay, ready? Let's do the second set. All right. And let's go. One. Two, three, four, 
five, six, seven, eight, almost there, nine, ten, eleven, beautiful guys, one more, and twelve, very nice, so we're going to take another 30 second break, then do the last one and move on to the third exercise. So let's breathe. So for the third exercise, what we're going to need the stool for like we did last week, we did squats from the chair. So we're going to do the same thing, you can use a chair or a stool. We're going to do three sets of 10 to 15 squats this time, okay? Sorry, 15 to 20. Okay, ready? This is the last set, then we're going to move on to the next exercise. All right, okay, get ready and go. One, two, make sure to keep breathing guys. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, Nine. Ten, we got two more. And one more. Twelve, beautiful guys. You guys did amazing. So that's your set, uh, sorry. Yeah, that was your third exercise in. Okay, now we're gonna do your fourth exercise, which is gonna be squats from a chair. So go ahead, get that stool that you got in the beginning. We're gonna get that set up and ready. We're gonna take a minute break. We're gonna breathe and then we're gonna get right into it. We're gonna do three sets of 15 to 20 squats this time, okay? so. If you can do 15, great. If you wanna, if you wanna be brave and get to 20, that's even better. But if 15 is enough, then that's okay, no problem, okay? But we're gonna do 20, three sets of 20. So the reason we're still doing them off of a chair is because I still want you to get learn the good form, the right form to do squats. And then in the in the in the in the next coming weeks, we'll to get rid of the stool eventually, and then you'll do it without any stool, okay? So you can just do body weight squats without any assistance. So we're gonna get ready to go now. So again, keep your feet a little bit wider than shoulder width apart. Take your hips back, sit on the chair, push down into the floor, stand back up. Take your hips through and squeeze your butt. One, and two. Make sure you keep your chest up, okay? Don't drop your chest like this. And when you're coming up, don't come up like this. Make sure you keep your chest up the whole time. Explode through and then come up. Three, four, keep breathing guys. Five, six, beautiful, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. So I want you to make sure you sit down fully, okay? Twelve. Don't just tap. Don't just tap and get up, sit down and then come up. 13, 14, 15, beautiful guys. You're doing amazing, 16, let's go. We can do four more, you can do it, come on. 17, good job guys. 18, two more, let me get a break, come on. 19, one more. And 20, beautiful. So now let's take a little break, 30 seconds. And then I'm gonna show you how to do this from the front. And I wanna make sure that your knees are not collapsing in when you're doing the squat, okay? Make sure to push the knees outside, okay? So let's breathe. So I'm gonna move the stool here this way this time, show you guys from the front. Okay, ready? So again, start, sit. When you get up, make sure your knees don't collapse in. Keep them outside the whole time, okay? So here's one. Take your hips back, explode, two. Three. Four, good job guys. Let's go. Five, beautiful. Six, seven, 
Eight, you're doing amazing. Nine. 10, beautiful. 11, 12, 13, beautiful. Push, 14, 15. Keep it up guys, keep it up. 16, four more, come on. 17, breathe, 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 breathe. 18. 19, 20, beautiful. Now, if you're feeling like your chest is falling forward a lot, and you're, if you do that, that's gonna start hurting your lower back. So don't do that, keep your chest up. Another way to do that is get your hands out here or get your hands up here, and that's gonna keep your chest up, okay? So keep your hands up here or here. I keep them here because my chest mostly stays up anyways because I'm so used to it, but if you're having trouble with that, try that, okay, okay? So now let's breathe. Now I'm gonna show you again from the side. Let's show you from this side this time. Third set, you're doing great guys. Ready? And let's go. Sit. One. So again, what I was saying was keep your hands like this. Two. And it'll keep your chest up. Three. Four. Five, six, good, good, good. Seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. 13, 14, good job guys, good job, let's go. 15, we got five more, you can do it, come on. 16, four more. 17, breathe, 18, 19, one more, and 20, beautiful. Three sets are done guys, three sets of 20 squats. That was a lot, I know. Probably feeling a lot of burn in your legs, but good job, you got it done, great work. If you did 15, if you did 12, no problem. You're still doing amazing. Now we're gonna take a little break for a minute and then we're gonna move on to our last exercise for the day. Keep breathing guys. So we did this exercise last week as well. It's called hyperextension. It's great for your lower back and to strengthen your lower back, especially if you have lower back issues. So we're gonna do this one again. We're gonna do three sets of 30 seconds, okay? But the 30 seconds are split up into 10 second intervals. So we're gonna go hard for 10 seconds. We're gonna take a five second break and then do it again for 10 seconds. Take a five second break and then do it again for 10 seconds. So that's gonna add up to 30 seconds and we're gonna do that for three times with a 30 second break in between. So I know it's a little complicated, but go, you'll, when you go through with me, you'll be fine. So ready, let's get started and get on the floor and lie down. Ready? So remember this, we're gonna squeeze our butt first, get our feet up as high as we can while keeping the legs straight. At the same time, we're also gonna keep our hands as high as we can and hold. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 10. Now we're gonna take a five second break. Four, three, two, one, and we're gonna go up again. One, two, Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Relax, five seconds, four, three, two, one, and up again. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Beautiful, guys. So, this is a great exercise to do to strengthen your lower back. Okay, especially if you have any back issues. So like you said, now we're gonna take a 30 second break and then we're gonna do that again for the second set. So let's breathe. And this workout should really get you sweating a lot. Cause did a lot of legs, a lot of cardio.
Okay, good job. So let's do the second set now, guys. Same concept. Make sure you squeeze your glutes first. Squeeze your butt, right? And then you're gonna get your legs as high as you can and get your arms as high as you can. Ready? And we're up. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. Relax, five second break. Four, three, two, and let's go up again. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and relax. Five, four, three, two, and we're up again. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. Beautiful, guys. Ooh, very nice. Uh, it's for a rosa laga hua. I'm a little tired today and very, very thirsty, but I'm guessing you guys are too. So it's great that we're doing it together and we're supporting each other. I'm loving it. Breathe, breathe, breathe. We got one more set. We're almost on the exercise, guys. You're doing great. <sighs> Keep breathing. <sighs> one more time. <sighs> Sweating today. Quite a bit, actually. It's good. It's the squats. Ready? And let's go. Ready? So squeeze your butt, legs up in the air, hands up, fight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and relax. Five, four, three, two, one, and we're up. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and relax. Five, four, three, two, one. Last time, guys. Let's go. Squeeze those glutes. Get your legs as high as you can, arms as high as you can. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Beautiful. Good job, guys. That's the workout pretty much done. Now we just got to do the stretch, and we're all on our way. So let's breathe. We're going to take a little break. And the stretch we're going to do is called the Cobra Stretch. It's a great stretch to help out stretch your lower back, your abs, okay? Your chest and your shoulders, especially for your abs because we'll be doing a lot of ab work these days. So I wanted you guys to take you guys through an ab stretch that'll really help out stretch your abs as well at the same time as your shoulder and your chest. So let's keep breathing and then we'll get right into it. Okay, so for this stretch, what you want to do is, again, we want to get back onto the floor and we're going to lie down, okay? And then from here, what you're going to do is you're going to get into push-up position, but you're not actually going to do a push-up. You're going to leave your lower body on the floor and just raise your upper body up. So you're going to go up like this and then you're going to look up for the roof. And you're going to hold this position and stretch. Breathe, take five breaths. That's three four, five, and then we're gonna go back down again, and we're gonna do it again. Push up again, one, two, three, four, five. We're gonna do it one more time, and push back up again, one, two, three, four, five. Good job. Very nice guys, that's how you do that Cobra stretch. Great for your lower, uh, for, your, for your abs actually, stretch out the abs because you've been doing a lot of ab work. And that's it guys, hope you guys enjoyed that workout. I'll see you guys in for next time for day nine. Very, 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 very good workout today. You guys did amazing. Thank you so much for watching and please share these videos with your friends and family that can find it beneficial as well. Take care guys.